Mildred? Oh! Oh, why, Dudley, it's you. I, I didn't think... Oh, where have you been? All of us have been worrying about you. And poor Mrs. Brom. What about Mrs. Brom? Well, she's been popping in and out of here all day, asking, have you seen Dudley? Have you heard from him? Where is she, Mildred? She and the bishop had some calls to make, finishing at Mrs. Hamilton's. Let me type that sermon for you. Oh, no, no. You go on. Oh, no, the bishop told well, it's me. It's almost Christmas Eve. You must have shopping to do. Oh. Well, Come on, Mildred. Thank you, Dudley. Merry Christmas, Mildred. Merry Christmas, Dudley. Take a sermon. Tonight, I want to tell you the story of an empty stocking. Once upon a midnight clear, there was a child's cry. A blazing star hung over a stable, and wise men came with birthday gifts. Have you got that? Good. We haven't forgotten that night down the centuries. We celebrated with stars hung on the Christmas tree and the cry of bells and gifts, especially with gifts. We buy them and wrap them and put them under the tree. You give me a tie, I give you a book. Aunt Martha always wanted an orange squeezer. Uncle Harry can use a new pipe. Oh, we forget nobody, adult or child. All the stockings are filled, all that is except one. Upstairs, Matilda. Tell Debbie I'll see her later. First, I have some work to do. I'll tell her. 